walk through the doors of Mochi Coffee and More off Trade Street, chances are you'll meet Sam Garrison. A bright smile, good coffee, and just feeling, maybe if they're in a bad mood, feeling like, feeling a better mood than they were. Sam is one of many baristas, or as they are called at this coffee shop, Mojistas. The nonprofit employs people with intellectual and developmental disabilities. The job skills and the support that they receive here is transferable onto you know, the next job opportunity into their life and however they can use that to grow and develop. The coffee shop was hit hard when COVID-19 first hit the triad, but Executive Director Timothy Flavin says with different events like the streetery on Friday nights, things are starting to pick back up. He also says they are raising money to build an outdoor deck. Our Mojistas are some of the best and most loyal employees that you could have. And the other issue is that we wanted to um, expose the community to people, neurodiverse people. And with less than 50 days until the election, the coffee shop is also partnering with several other organizations to help people with disabilities in another way. The event called Rev Up will help folks register to vote request a mail-in ballot, and we'll even provide them with a voter registration card, all in an effort to continue to make a difference in the community. That's our end goal, is really to um, uh, impact as many lives as we can. In Winston-Salem, Justin Schreier, WXII 12 News. The voter registration fair will be held next Tuesday from noon until 7.30 at the Winston Junction Market up the street from Moji Coffee. We have a link to registration on our website, WXI12.com.